What's up guys, it's Sneaky Puppers here, uh, back again with another Octopath Traveler part, part 9 I believe. Um, if you guys are enjoying the series, uh, don't forget to like and subscribe if you haven't already. If you've missed any of the parts, I've got a playlist on my channel so you guys can go check it out there. Um, last part, we have just finished wrapping up Alfin's story. And I believe next is Primrose, the dancer. Yes, uh, it's sunshade in the sunlands. So currently we are here, Clearbrook. It's so touchy on the mouse. Um, so we'll probably make our way down to her and then Hunnet is still level 27. So I'm not sure, maybe if we do Primrose and then Old Brick, if we'll be 27 yet. Therions. We only need to be level 22 to do. So we could maybe do Primrose and then Tressa. And then I guess we could, or maybe we could do Primrose and then fast travel back here. Do Ophelia and then go to Therion. I'm not sure, we have options, but uh, we'll definitely do Primrose next. Um, so yeah, let's start heading towards what is this called again? Sunshade. Out of the town. I don't know if there's anything else they want to say. Oh, the little kitty. I can still steal off the... I don't want to steal off the good people. What the little chickens. Do I need a rest after everything? Nah. We're all full health. Hello. Have you seen my daughter Miro around by any chance? That's just reminded me. What am I doing? That's right, end of last part. There was a side story up here. What's the bet? This is the daughter Meryl. So let's actually, yeah, we'll, we'll do a side story because we haven't done that yet. And that might help level us up. Nice day, isn't it? My name's Meryl. Say, would you mind lending me an ear? Something's happened that I can't tell anyone else about. Dish the tea. You see, I found a bottle floating in the river. Odd thing is, there was a letter inside. Want to know what it said? To my Meryl. I loved you dearly, but had no choice but to put you in the care of another. I hope you have found happiness wherever life has taken you. From far away, your mother. But I have parents right here in Clearbrook. I want to ask them about this, but I'm scared of what they'll tell me. So begins the tale of Meryl, and that disappeared too quickly for me to read. Um, what do you have? Let's just... <laughs> Am I gonna steal? Probably not. I'm, I'm not, I'm not trying to get a plum and pomegranate for 15% ch chance of success. Okay, so let's go talk to the mum, which is down here. Hello. Yes, we have. Can I not? Did I not enter like a quest with her? Frustrating. What do you want from me? Jay? Inquire. Right, right. I forgot about this. Hidden item. A new treasure is available somewhere. Now if we go talk to her? Hello. What the hell? Inquire? A loving mother. Yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Nice chatting with you. No. You've gained new information. A hidden item. Is that just spawning a random tree? Oh, is it this glowy thing? Examine. Aid what? Okay, so that's not what we need. Why is it so hard to start a quest? <laughs> That's so good. Oh, this is uh, Alfin's hey. friend. Don't happen to know anything, do you? Doubt it. Okay, it does say just a hidden item. Who are you? 
Alfin always gives me fish that he catches from the river, but he saves the biggest ones for himself, of course. If it weren't for Zeph, we'd be coughing our lungs out every day. I don't think he lets us forget that for a second. And then there's Meryl, who would kill- Would it kill her to acknowledge me from time to time? Just the other day, I gave her some flowers, but she just mumbled thank you and kept staring off in the distance. I swear it's like her mind is somewhere else. Maybe she's just not that into you, bro. Ooh, here's another. Shiny olive bloom. The fact is... Oh, Meryl's father! No father has ever been more proud of his daughter than I am of Meryl. I love her dearly, but she does not know the whole story. Okay, let's inquire with him. Meryl's past. Yes, okay, this is what we want. Now can we go talk to Meryl about it? Nice day, isn't it? My name is Meryl. Say, would you mind lending me an ear? Something's happened that I can't tell anyone else about. You see, I found a bottle. We've been over this all before. Okay, let's just skip past. Share what you know. Yes, this is what we want. What's this you say? I I wasn't I'm not You're saying I was not born here? But that can't be true. It can't be true. I mean her parents look pretty old. I fear it is, my love. Father, mother. Forgive us, my dear. We should have told you long ago. It was 19 years ago. A woman came to our doorstep carrying a small babe. The pig. With tears in her eyes, she told us the girl's name was Meryl and begged us to look after the child until she could return. We had no children of our own, though we did long for them. You're a gift from the heavens. But we waited for your mother to come back and claim you. But the weeks turned into months and the months to years. In time, we came to think of you as our own daughter. We, not may be your f we, we may not be your flesh and blood, but we love you more than anyone else in this world. And I love you too, mother and father. But I must find the person who wrote this message. Forgive me. But you might have answers. Answers that I have long been searching for. Do what you must, my love. We shall pray that the flame guides your path. Thank you, Father. Whoever put the bottle in the water must be somewhere along the river. I'll set out as soon as I've packed my things. I'll find the person who wrote that letter. I'll find the answers I seek. and a resilient nut Whoa! okay nice I'll take it um, that was a pretty sad first side story quest but okay at least we made bank off it okay let's start heading out then I see there's another orange oh there's another one here okay we, we better do it while we're here right who are you angler ha it's an ill-fated time to be a fisher, I tell ye. The plounder are disappearing from these waters. Gods only know why. How can I feed my kin if it nets come up empty? So begins. Okay, what do you know? Just a hidden item. Um, are we supposed to like find a fish for him? These side quests like are kind of hard to figure out. What Hello. Hi. Okay, doubt it. Doubt you're who I need to talk to. What about you? Okay, found that lost item. We'll hit an item. More pomegranate. What about you? I don't really talk to you. Get out of here. Get out of here. Gertis. Fuck off. <laughs> Ooh, a discount at the end. Demand Badu. 
Must be level 10 or higher to inquire something of this person. I wonder if that's what we need for the this dude down here. So I've talked to everyone and I can't seem to figure it out unless we just need to like hand him food or something that we don't have. So let's just bounce. Maybe we'll come back to it later. Probably not, to be honest. <laughs> we'll see. Okay. This way, maybe? Let me just check the map again. Yeah, I think if we continue heading this way, we should be good. Hello. Fishmonger. Oh, maybe we need to talk to this dude. I need to burst him with plunder. Aren't I talking to... Aren't I taking too many, you ask? Puh. There's plenty of fish in the sea or river, such as it were. Well, apparently there's not, mate. Surely you're who I need to inquire about. None. What if we just steal his fish? Dude seems like a bit of a dick anyway. Is edible a type of fish? Like, I don't know. Sturdy shield, I kind of want to, kind of want to take that. I'm going to do it. 80%, surely. Come on. Oh, shit. We got caught. Uh, not your hard earned catch. We're just trying to steal your shield. Jeez. Nearly impact your reputation on the town. Townsfolk will not respond to your path actions if you have poor reputation. Fortunately, the bartender at the tavern can fix your reputation for a fee. Damn. Fail four more times and your reputation will suffer. So it didn't even suffer that one time. It's fine. Well, it doesn't seem like he has anything. What if we beat him up? Teach him a lesson. <laughs> okay. We got... So it's 3v3. I wonder if you just keep getting... um more enemies the more amount of times um, what am I saying who knows I wonder if you get more enemies the more party members you have break the shield what next I don't really like Alfin's um attacks that much He's good for healing, but outside of that, kind of eh. TBH. And that attack annoys me how much it misses. Here goes nothing. Um, let's just attack with that and break this turn shield. <laughs> My turn. Mm, maybe the axe. No. Nope. Bring it on. Oh, you're in there next as well. My turn. And Therion can do the stabby stab. What next? Gary is pretty tanky, not gonna lie. There we go. Got him. Yeah, so we got Hannah at 11. She's got a long way to go to 27, though. Yay! Another chest. It's a grape. At this point, I just shouldn't expect anything other than grapes or plums. I kind of want to go back and beat up. Okay, I'm gonna go back and beat up the fisherman, fisherman dude. Fight me, bro. Strength three. Now nah, we can take him. What's going on here? These are my fish, mine. Yeah, I wonder. Yeah, it does sound like that is what we need to do. Come in, if thou darest. Oh, it's one v one. I keep forgetting it's one v one. Okay, let's. No. Not one more of swords. That's okay. I will not let in the hunt. Miss bitch. Why doesn't she have her weapons in this? That's interesting. Is it supposed to be like a fist fight or some shit? Um. Hmm. 
let's try the laughing hyena. Cause we got a few. Oh my god, yeah, that does the damage. Coming, if thou darest. Yeah, might as well do another one. Coming. Oh shit, he actually deals a lot of damage. Um. Yep, laughing hyena again. Letting the hunt begin. It. And again, or well, maybe we'll try and burn him with the viper. Kind of think I should eat a grape, but nah, got him. I honor thee, my quarry. It's so good. And level twelve, nice. But we didn't get any fish. Oh, here we go. Yeah, yes, Katsu. I beg ye forgiveness. I can't deny it. I went a bit mad for the plounder. And I couldn't stop hauling more out. <laughs> so yeah, the bra you're the brazen faced filch who took all the plounder. Yikes. You won't see me in this village again. You have me word. And look, I'll give you all my plounder. Here, just let me be. I'm in your debt, traveller. Now that the poacher's been chased off, the plounder have returned. I didn't know what I was going to do until you came and saved the day. I can't thank you enough, traveller. Woo! Another 1500 and a mighty belt. Hopefully that's good. Let's, um, let's check that out. Equipment. What would belt be under body? Or is it an accessory? It is an accessory. What does it do? Physical attack 50! Holy shit, that's a good one. I might give that to Therion. Because we probably use his physical attack more than anything. Anyone else. And he doesn't have an accessory yet, so. Mighty belt like might look good on him. Who knows? Try again. Woo, we got Therion to level 11 and we got Alphen to level 8. That was nice. That was a good, good battle. Okay, let's continue. Heading our way down to Primrose. Hopefully this is the right way. South Clear Book Traverse. Danger level 7. That's all good. We're all above that, I think. And just to make sure I'm heading the right way. Yes, this is the right path. Seems like the aesthetic hasn't changed since Althan's one, but maybe in the next Let area. Letting my arrow fly in true. And that's that. I think we want to head upwards. So maybe not. Do we want to go through a cave? Now let's go this way. For now, at least. Oh, there's a chest over there. How am I supposed to get up there? Oh, looks like there's a path to the left. Up around. Yep. Should know that by now. Always go the other way. 500. That was worth it. Let's Wasn't just a great. That's all good. My turn. Got two more of the waspy boys and two more of the toad boys. Should we just flee? Yeah. Yes. I want to get to the new area and start seeing the new enemies. So I do want to level up. Pun it. While we're here. Okay, so this looks like it's Southern Sunshade Sands. This should be near. Ooh, what a change. Just just with one bridge. Okay, so this is very dizzy looking. A plum. In the desert. Ooh, another chest. I'll make this quick. Ooh. 
It's like my big ants and then... What the hell is that thing? Like a cockroach pushing a watermelon? <laughs> what the hell? Okay. Let's do Lindy, because she'll get them all. I was going to say that she'll get them all, but she did that bounce attack instead. How does the damage... Yeah, it's a wee bit, a wee bit of damage. I think stabbing the ant should work, yeah. Here goes nothing. I don't know how effective Alpha would be. Oh yeah, X's are good. Nice. Here goes nothing. Is there anything? Icicle. Dire Army Ant. So that one's got like a yellow name under it. Maybe that means it's like more dangerous. Let's just do the axe because we know it's vulnerable to it. Same with you. Just stab it. We want to get rid of that one as fast as possible, I think. Nice, that one broke. The cockroach with the watermelon shield. Actually, what is its name? Cactus Roller. Oh, it's a cactus! Hmm. Interesting. Oh, okay, so the, the red name must mean it's low health. How often I noticed that yet? Oh, hi, thanks for checking in. I'm still a piece of garbage. Okay, I should just have to do this. I should die. It's not doing the sweep attack. She's just doing that single target attack. I'm gonna hit this one instead. <laughs> I'm just hoping it would die on the poison. Oh, yes, it did. Out of my way. Nice. Too easy. Letting my arrow fly and true. Maybe it's bungled arrows. The hunt sure. Ended. Doesn't matter. It killed it. Essence of plum. Right. Let's see what's in this chest. Herb of clarity. Looks like the town that we're looking for is up here. And I'll obsessively save. No, I'll save when I get to the town. I don't need to save there. Okay, this looks like the entryway. Sunshade. Oh, on, shit, that gave me a fright. What are you? You're like a like dinosaur with like hair. Hmm. Should we try Wildfire? Maybe HP Thief, since he is a teeny bit low. Sand Lizard Man the second? <laughs> Interesting. Is it because this one is Oh, this is Sand Lizard Man the third. So who's Sand Lizard Man the first? That's funny. Okay, let's let's have a go at Sand Lizard Man the second. Steal some of his health. Yep. Now we're back up to full. That's a really good skill. I like that a lot. I wasn't expecting it to do as much damage as it does. Doesn't have a lot of health. I was just All thinking right. maybe we should capture it, but... I'm not sure. I'll see how strong it is. Coming, if thou darest. Whoa, that hits really hard. Let's see if I capture it. 100%. Strength 3, skills double strike. Capture this photo. Yeah, I'm sure we've still got like a pretty low level. No, we were. There's only one left in that mossy meat though. Ah, uh, still, we'll get rid of the Marmot. Oh, this is magic. Nah, we'll get rid of Marmot because we've got Lindy for the sword damage. Yeah. Okay. Bye, Mamo. All right. Did I say no? What did I say yes? I wasn't paying enough attention. Oh well. It is what it is. <laughs> oh shit. Elfin's getting fucked up. Where's the nearest town? Okay, well he's. Should heal up and then enter the town. And he's level nine. 
He just needs to get good. Okay, let's into the, the new city. Oh, this is nice. It's got like, if you listen, it's got like people talking in the background. So maybe this is a bit bigger than the other villages we've seen. Who are you? This is Sunshade, city of a thousand pleasures. Got any information for us? No. Don't worry then. Ah, uh, do we need to sleep? Oh, Alfin leveled up, so that healed him. I mean, we could sleep. It's only sixty dollars. We'll just get back Therion's SP and the little bit of health that Hunnit had drained. Why not? What about you? How are you? I've never been down there by myself, but I hear the passage just past here leads out somewhere in the sands. It does indeed. New weapons for sale. Interesting. That's cool. I like that. We're looking for primrose, so let's keep an eye out. Got an item. What do you oh. actually say? There are dancers. These these are the dancers' dormitories. Oh, she's so she's probably inside here. Let's quickly go in. Oh, this is the armor. Ooh, okay. What what weapons do you have? War spear. We don't have that. I assume Primrose then has a spear. Iron dagger. Arcane knife. That might be quite good. Uh, it's not that big of a jump. Uh, elemental attack's a bit of a jump there. Piercing dagger, that's massive. But that's seven grand. That's a lot. That's a lot of money. I don't think I'm... I don't think I'm ready to spend that, that kind of money yet. This looks quite good, though. Maybe. Holy shit. That's 9,600. It is 89 physical defense, but that's a lot. I'm so cheap. <laughs> Fur robe, that might be... That might be a good one. Definitely levels up the elemental defense for Hunter and Elfin. That's only 1800. Um, let's wait and see what we get for Primrose, because we might need to upgrade her thing, and I'm not sure how much that'll cost yet. I'm a bit of a money hoarder in games. <laughs> um, okay, so there's the dancers thing in here then, I assume. Hello? No one's home. No chest just lying about either. To the left, maybe? We'll find someone? Ah, there she is! I believe that's Primrose. Who are you? Oh. What with that mighty cliff that towers above us, sunshade is cloaked in shadow, even during the day. Probably quite good, you're in, if you're in the middle of the desert. Okay, useless. I'll save. And I want to finish exploring the town and then I'll talk to Primrose. Ah, uh, what do you have? What can I steal from you? 8%? don't think so. Is this... Yeah, no, we don't need you. There's that hidden item just up here. Silver filled pouch. What is that? Is there another accessory? No. Okay, so the silver filled pouch is just for selling. That's okay. We should use our nuts. <laughs> um, yeah, let's see. Who do we want to use it on? Increase maximum SP. Mm. I still think we should be doing Hunt it because we use. I mean, we do use Lindy a lot. So maybe we should do Therion. 
Let's do theory on this, even it up. And elemental defense. Well, the reason why I don't want to invest too much into Alfin is because I don't know if he's going to be on my permanent party yet. I definitely want to keep, well I have to keep Hunter and I definitely want to keep Therion on. So I don't mind investing into these two guys yet. Um, let's just do Hunter. Can I, is this like a secret way into that building? No? Okay. Not yet, I think we just need to walk down the middle, this main area here. What does this guard have to say? Yeah. Master's lackey. This tavern is Master's Master Halganish's Halganish's Halganish shiz. I just said the same name three times over. Good work. Uh, Pride and joy. He he's particularly fond of the dances. If you catch my meaning. I will steal from you. Portrait with a kiss. 80%. I mean, Therion didn't do it last time at 80%, so he's, he's got to make up for it now, right? Yes. Nice work, Therion. Let's go inside. This is the tavern. This is a very grand tavern. Oh my god. Who's this dude to the side? He looks like a mobster boss. Whoa, I can't do anything with him. He must be like a main story character. Oh no, it's because he's the fucking tavern owner. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, we don't need to restore reputation here. Do you have any tales? No. Equipment, I don't think I need to do anything. Oh, that's funny. Well. Um, I've come to rest my travel wearing body for a while. No better place, place in the realm, I say. You? Well, well. Good food, good drink, and the dancing girls are easy on the eyes. If only the prices were a bit more reasonable. Got the neat thing? Nah, you're all very low chance. I ain't risking it. Hello. Dancing girls here put on quite a show. Is that it? Yeah. Good show. <laughs> I travelled across half the realm to visit this place. They say there's a girl here who dances like a goddess. I bet that's Primrose. Do you have any information? I haven't been asking these guys. No, you don't. I feel like I'm just going to be... An exorbitant price of sold, but it's only 3%. I mean, we could risk it because there's only. You, you've got to do it four times to lower your reputation. I'll do it once. I'll do it once. Okay, ready? Wait a minute! Who are you? Uh, I mean, yeah, that wasn't, that wasn't likely, but. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, okay? It's a lot of money. Hello. What around town is that the dancers here put on private shows for the master, if you know what I mean. He. Who is this master? Discount at the inn. That would be nice before I actually rested up there. A merchant in desperate search of a good time. Since the recent burst of his birth of his first child, he has found it considerably more difficult to carouse close to home in Victor's Hollow. And so he is taken to frequent to frequenting Sunshade instead. <laughs> Maybe I, I I haven't really been reading these stories. Maybe I should be. Undeniable allure. Your townspeople will be more. Oh, alluring must be her um Primrose's special ability. That's funny. I 
think there's some stairs out back there that I can go up as well. Then I'll go talk to Primrose. What is this? Oh, look, we're out on stage. Pump the music. <laughs> I think this way? Nah. Get them to dance like a boy band. No. <laughs> Never mind. I'm getting distracted. Let's go talk to Primrose. Okay, so I just went to quickly sell off our stuff and holy shit. It's worth eight grand. So maybe we can get that expensive um, knife for theory on. Wow. I don't even remember where we got that. That's so good. Did we steal that off someone? And that's only worth 15. We stole that. I remember stealing that. Wow. We got 19k, guys. We are loaded. Um, I think before I talk to Primrose and then start a whole series of um, cutscenes, I might leave this part here. So, if you guys enjoyed, don't forget to hit like and subscribe if you haven't already. Uh, stay hydrated and drink some water. And I'll see you guys next time. Laters!